What's up guys, we are still talking about what is going on, what is trending in Nigerian politics. Greetings to you wherever you are. Uh, still a beautiful Tuesday morning, 7 November 2023. Okay, um, as we already know, Peter V had a press conference yesterday, 6 Monday, uh, on the 6 Monday, November 2023, and um, uh, Babadati also had an interview that same yesterday, and then I will allow you to listen to what he said. He has just re-echoed what most of us has been crying for over rigging of election. Whenever Dati, you know, speaks, there is this, there is always something to take home from, yeah, whenever he talks. Now, still talking about democracy, according to him, it is not over yet. That Labour Party won election. It is not over yet. Still building up coming 2027. Let me allow you to listen to what uh, Babadati have to say. If you have anything to contribute from what he said, let me know on the comment section below. Ready to do this. As I'm speaking to you, the likes of my former friend who would say is treason is all that. I am educating Nigerians. Rise up for your, for your rights. No justice of Supreme Court will give you democracy. You will have to go about the, the let me, let me to reverse that. Let me okay. They will. I mean, they Nigerians, this is this constitutionally is, no, legal. No, 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 no. Constitution and legal. And this is where I defer. With all modesty, okay, I don't mind being alone on this, but I know I'm not breaking any, any law and I've never had a criminal record. So what are you actually but calling on the finish. people to do? I, I'm, well, calling, I'm trying to understand what you're saying. I'm getting to that. Sure. I'm so we're running out of time. So I'm, I'm saying yeah. that, and again, this is, um, this is instructive. I'm saying that we the people that stood to form the Nigerian constitution today, it is not over. For we the people, power is that which remains standing when there is nothing to oppose it. A leader is he who remains followed when there is nobody to challenge. Authority is that which is implemented when there is nothing to stop it. They have the leaders in place now with wielding authority, with political power. But power and sovereignty belongs to the Nigerian people. We the people. On whose behalf an elected government is exercising that authority. Now where the people are dissatisfied um, with the rulings of their courts, they own Nigeria, and Haji Tinubu does not own Nigeria, Peter Obi does not own Nigeria. Yeah, but the ABC, Nigerians on the streets right. own Nigeria. But the ABC, listen, I'm getting to the point. You the ABC me, would argue that you I'm don't listening. own Nigeria either, that, that you, you, just, you have a portion of the election that not voted over. for you. I'm not telling you it is right. not over. I'm telling you it is not over. For Peter Obi and me, it is over. For we, the people, the Nigerian people, right. at any point in time, they can take back Nigeria. Right. Especially where their constitution has been violated. Especially where all that the Supreme Court ended up doing was to sustain the unconstitutionality right. well, of let, a certain election. Let me come in here. Because yes. between now and 2027, yes. which is when the next presidential election is due, how do you think things will play out? And what role do you see yourself and Peter B and the Labour Party playing in that? When the Nigerian people rise to defend their constitution, anything can happen. And well, that, this sounds, is not, that sounds quite a bit worryingly I'm, frightening. Look, we, are, we, are, we are in a worryingly frightening situation. I told you I'm not here to repeat what you've been hearing. And I was prepared to come here. I have never had a criminal record. I love my peace. And I'm repeating that when the Nigerian people decide, Nigeria is theirs for the ticket. And any fraudulently 
government, elected government, is fair game for them. Nigerian people have the right, the constitutional right. As we speak now, DSS can go and interpret. They have lawyers there, police, IG and M, they can go and interpret. The Nigerian people have that power. Not Obi or Atik or anybody. Nigerian people have the power at any point in time to take their country. All they have to do, not even seek approval. They give notice. It's interesting. And listen. Right. You turn away the barrel of your guns, away from the Nigerian people, and point them at the enemies of Nigeria. Mm. This country belongs to Nigerians. Well, you've made that when, point. When Nigerians decide, mm. but if they want to practice democracy, right. they will take this country. It has happened before. The military decided they took Nigeria for so long, they fixed Nigeria and handed it back. Now, whoever thinks that the Supreme Court will give democracy from any courtroom, the way it appears now is mistaken. It, it's Nigerians interesting. Nigerians have to go out. Right. You, you, and, you, you and made that point. Nigerians have to go out right. and, and democracy. And this is not a treasonable comment. Right. I am not a careless person. Mm. I have never. I so you say fought the things you say. I fought it through very, right. very well. Well, this is the, the Constitution is made by Nigerian people. The Supreme Court is a sub of a sub of one chapter that the Nigerian people constitutionally right. came out okay. that we the people, and the same constitution says that no person or group